guys, welcome back to my vlog. Um, it's really sunny out, sorry I'm squinting. I'm currently eating lunch outside. It's super windy out too, sorry if you can't hear me. Just made some juice, pineapple and celery with a little bit of ginger. Mm, so good, love it. Um, but yeah, welcome back. I don't know, I think this week's vlog, or this vlog, might be this whole week, or it could be today and tomorrow. I don't really know. We don't know what's going on, so I guess stay tuned. We'll see. We'll see what happens. I love Disney so much. This is so cool. I love Disney. Okay, so me and Brooke just went to Starbucks, and they've got this new dragon fruit mango refresher thing, and. Holy crap, it's so freaking good. I can't. Like, it's, oh, it's so good. I don't want to say it's good. I am a piranha. I live in the Amazon. transition from yesterday's chunk of vlog to today's chunk of vlog with what I'm doing right now, right in the middle. Um, so this is kind of a story time, but it's, uh, it's not a lot of a story, but it's also something I've never shared with anyone because I was just too embarrassed to <laughs> say or do anything about it. Um, so I was a Viner, little known facts, I had like a hundred followers something along that line. Um, I remember right before Vine, like, literally died, I screenshotted my number of, um, my, like, number of views and everything, so if I have that screenshot, I will insert it right now. Okay, um, so, I will also insert my, my comp, my, like, three-minute compilation of Vines, um, either in this video or that'll be the next video that will pop up, um, and I'll link it, something like that, I don't know. Basically, I was a Viner. I wasn't a very popular Viner. I wasn't, like, obviously, you've never heard of my Vines. Um, but, so I used to do a lot of, like, the remakes, like a lot of people did. Vine was, if you don't, if you weren't actually on Vine, you're only seeing the originals of things. But if somebody created a vine that was funny beyond all belief, everyone would remake that same vine over and over and over. Um, sometimes a remake would become more popular than the original was. I know I remade the, like, uh, babysitting the weird kid vine. That's in my compilation of, like, my sister being really creepy. Um, so I did recreate vines. And when vine first started, I also, like, I, this is how much of an OG viner I was. I literally remember Vine starting and me being like, I have to get this app on my phone, it sounds so funny, and I typed it up and they didn't have it for Androids yet. That was like how, that was how new Vine was. So I literally sat there and I waited until the news said that like, Vine was getting an app for Android. Um, before then it was literally, you could download Vine and it was just a camera, but you couldn't post it anywhere. It was just like, you could film seven second videos. Um, so I would remake awful, just like I was awful at vining when I first started. Not that my vines were that great, but I was awful. And there was this one specifically that I did, and it was, if I can find it, I will insert the clip right here. I do not address how cringy that is, and I just want to say that I am so deeply sorry that you had to deal with how cringy that video was. Please continue. My mind, recreating is like telling the artist that they did it and that you love that so much that you want to try to attempt to do something like them. It's like, you know, where like copying is the most sincere form of flattery. But I was like a no-name viner. I didn't have any hashtags on that vine. I didn't have like anything on that vine. I was just posting things and being like, oh, my, like, five followers at the time can see this and laugh real good about it. It was, like, my friends, too. So I was like, whatever. Um, but I go on one day, and I have, like, 
Who notifications? Um, and it says, Tyler, the creator, has commented on your Vine. And I was like, who the hell is Tyler, the creator? Sorry, PSA, didn't know who Tyler, the creator, was at that time. Um, and I don't remember what he commented on one of my Vines, but he commented, like, on an original piece of trash or something like that on the varies one. And I literally remember looking at it being like, oh my gosh, this is online bullying. Like, I was so personally offended that Tyler, the creator, because at the time I didn't know who Tyler, the creator was, um, that he, like, some kid somewhere in the universe went on and tried to bully me on Vine. And then after clicking on his profile and, like, looking at it and realizing how famous he was, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm famous. But I've never shared that story specifically because I was very nervous to tell people, like, oh, Tyler, like, and it was his actual account, too. It was literally Tyler, the creator, that went out, hunted my Vine account down, and decided to comment hate comments on my Vines. So I don't know if that's, like, the best, like, that Tyler, the creator, commented hate comments, but, like, it was his legit account, and he did that, and I was like, oh my gosh, this celebrity commented on one of my Vines, two of my Vines, with hate comments, but I've never shared that with anyone because I just thought that, like, wow, people are gonna think I'm an awful Viner, even though I am. Like, people are gonna look down on me if they know that Tyler, the Creator, has, like, looked down on me as well. Like, no one's gonna like me if Tyler, the Creator, doesn't like me. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's my story time. Who set up on the car? Hey guys, um, so this is day two of vlogging right here. Um, I am on my way to hopefully surprise my boyfriend at work. We don't necessarily know what's going to happen because he's not, he's supposed to be off in 30 minutes and it is about an hour away from here. So, uh, I'm probably not going to get lucky and be able to pull up and him be right there. I'm probably going to get a text in a hot second here where he's like, oh, let's meet here. I'm already there and I'm going to be like... Well, frick, I'm at your place of work. Great. But, um, I'm excited. I haven't seen him in so long. This is so... Eee! I'm so excited. Yeah, that's it. I would just like to apologize because the next video looks like I was smoking weed or something. Because I'm so, like, tired and I'm really sorry about that. But I promise it was just tired and sad, okay? That's it. That's it, I promise. Okay, so everyone says like they never see me like sad or upset or anything like that and I, I know that that happens because I'm a very energetic person who doesn't show their feelings very often, but I'm going to end this vlog on kind of a sappy note. Basically, I did surprise my boyfriend. He loved this, the surprise of me being there early. Also, it's like midnight right now, so, so I'm kind of tired too, but... He's just such a great human being, and I, I just don't know how I survive without him on a day-to-day -day basis sometimes. <laughs> I just appreciate having him in my life so much. I'm just so sad whenever I have to part ways. But, uh, yeah, that's that, I guess. Um, thanks for watching my vlog today, or this past two days. Yeah.